morning guys well it's a whopping 43 degrees how does that feel to you z yeah. and we got a busy day we're yeah, off to the market to be, it seems to be hitting you harder than me oh always i'm old mm -hmm. remember old people get cold easy mm -hmm. oh my goodness it's just hey wait we can't see you good see there you go Okay, I was about to say, no, we can't see you good. We can see me fine. You're the pretty one. I'm the one with the brains. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, boy. All right. Well, let's get to the market. We'll get food for the animals. Um, although, this whole week is so cold, we still have to get cold food for the mammals mm -hmm. the tortoises are inside they'll get little bits to eat but not much inside yep. and they don't need it because they're all fattened up all year round so and not to mention the cold kind of slows them down yes too. the cold slows them down but they're put inside yeah in the heat yeah so we'll get all the mammal food get that done and we'll show you guys around the market today and well, you'll I'll show you guys around the market. Z's got to yeah. work at the uh, stand. stand to help those people out who donate a lot of uh, food for us for the animals. Mm -hmm. All right, let's get there, and we'll see you guys at the market. All right, well, we made it to the market and it's cold. And guess what? John is nowhere to be found. That's right. It's too cold for him to come out. <laughs> but uh, Timmy's here, working the market. Oh, what's up? How you doing? Dude, it's cold. A little bit. It's, it's, it's more than chilly today. But uh, let's go take a look at this stuff. So what's, oh, only one thing of dip left. That's mine. <laughs> oh, no smoked salmon left. Dude, you're selling everything today. Barely any shrimp here. Those are Key West pinks? No. Nope. What were those? Those are 11, um, I mean, sorry. Those are, uh, shit, those are pink peeled into vein. Okay. That's the only shrimp you have left? Holy smokes, dude, that's good job. Oh, look at that piece of salmon. You got grouper? Oh, yeah, like four pieces. What about Chilean? Yeah, like one. You're Not selling even a pound. You're selling out of everything, bro. That's awesome. Maybe John should stay home more often. Frog legs, gator. <laughs> crab cakes. And more crab cakes in that one. Look at the hat. I know, the fish. It's so funny. That is cool. That is cool. Oh, man. All right. Well, I'm going to go show these people around the market so they can see what it's like here during uh, the holiday season when it's busy. All right, buddy. All right. I'll catch up with you in a little while, bro. Yep. Let's go, guys. Let's go check out what goes on at the market. Oh. You got all kinds of stuff for sale here. Plants, dresses, shirts, more veggies and stuff and more clothes, birds, all kinds of stuff, man. The market is slammed this time of year. And we're going to the backside where they handle the uh, old stuff and where Seattle sets up. We'll see if Seattle's here today and go check out some cool stuff. Let's head back there. Look, more clothes, more food. All kinds of uh, cool stuff. 
now walk around and show you guys some stuff. How's that sound? All right, let's head to the back and start back there and work our way forward. All right, it's kind of dead back here because people are already packing up. But here's one of my favorite people, Matt. What are you wearing? Yeah. It's my Christmas outfit. <laughs> A little elf there. Check out all this cool stuff Matt's got on his table. Oh, that's a cool mask. That's cool. All these crosses. You guys know I collect the crosses. I actually got a couple of my last rites crosses from Matt. He always finds these cool things at garage sales. And cool, cool treasures. How about a Darth Vader? mask oh look at that that's cool oh. all right we're gonna go see what's left here and look around a little and Matt once again cool stuff and that's one of your pieces huh yeah Amazing, amazing artwork, dude. These two. Amazing. And you still haven't started your YouTube channel, have you? I started it, but I haven't kept up enough. But I need to. I need to do more. What's your YouTube channel? Uh, Matt the Hagler. Matt the Hagler, on YouTube. Make sure you guys check him out. And hopefully, we get on his butt to start filming stuff. <laughs> But good luck. <laughs> oh. All right, let's go walk around and check out stuff, guys. All right, walking around. Ken's not here today. Matt just told me. But at the market, you can find all kinds of cool stuff. A lot, a lot of neat stuff. guy with the bonsai trees not here today. Snowshoes, anyone need those? There's some cool stuff. Always, always cool stuff in the market. Today's an early day, boy. Backing up already. over here fishing rods Stuff over here. Oh, look at the skulls. Some nice skulls. This is the guy who does the leather, leather work. Those are all bison. Some long horns. Cool stuff. Cool, cool stuff. Quick and 
see what they got. This guy's always got some cool stuff. Good fight. All right, let's get in, in there. All right, I'm gonna go back over here to check out these leather pouches and all. There's Harvey. I knew those were his skulls. But that's Harvey. <laughs> you guys know him. He, he was Mr. Auctioneer the one time we did a unit a long time ago. Look at all that. Oh, Harvey's back. I, I saw him. I saw him. Oh, uh, nothing. Just looking around. And what you got your boy up there? He's out working on the other side of the market. Down there, I've old Mexico. They got a grandson set up up there in the, a big market of Canton, Texas. He'd open every day. Some days a week. They bought every buffalo skull I could possibly get to them, you know, for a hundred dollars a piece on the regular ones. Right. Oh, I get these big ones around there. Where's hell them? I sell them two twenty-five. Don't take less than two hundred public. One hundred twenty-five for you. All right. I got four here, and I got. Maybe four up. I don't know what I got, four or five up at the shed. Six, maybe. And uh, Longhorn Skull site. Of course, there, you got a real skull, you got real horns, but they come from two different critters they've been screwed on. They yeah. You came. Yep. Well, before, these other people, a couple different places, you know, they were putting a round plug in there and they're putting the horn on, on it. Horn. That, these people, they screw the horn right into the skull. Right, right. Uh, make a unicorn. <laughs> Make your elusive unicorn. Where the skull was? Now you can talk to the man himself. Your unicorn. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Gary Smith. You live right there next door to us? No. He had uh, the miniature buffaloes. Oh, really? Yeah, miniature buffaloes and giraffes. Buffalo. We the one you get fans. Giraffes and all kinds of stuff. He had giraffes too? Yes, sir. Giraffes when we first camel. moved out there, I'm yeah. sure did. Wow. Oh my goodness. That would piss me off. he was a retired New York trooper, so he was pissed off most of the time anyway. He got up pissed off. This guy always he he does do some amazing work with yeah. stuff. That would be. I bet he would. I'll bet he would. Yeah, bet he would. Love these cow hides. We bought one uh, during the first Sunday about what, about three years ago. Hi. Right? She's, She's gone. Yes, yeah, she is. She's, she shopped. All right, brother. Hundred dollars. Damn. One just like that right there. That's not bad. Oh no, shoot. That's not bad. They go for a lot more than that. Yeah. That is good. All right, brother. Take care. You too. You too. All right, let's go look. All right. Here we go. Check out my friend's table. This is the guy from Kenya. His cousin brings in all this stuff. What you doing? Where's the crocodile? Christmas crocodile. Where? No, after uh, this... Time. After this hey. time. <laughs> but check out all his cool stuff. Yeah. There's some nice elephants, giraffes, 
this, wow. And all this stuff is hand carved in Kenya. And then his cousin brings it over and has a big place and he sells a bunch here at the market. There's some nice, nice stuff. Look at that. No two are the same because they are hand carved. Got some amazing stuff. All right, that's a nice piece. You got a stool with them and everything. They even make CD holders, cap things over there. How about a pineapple? Anybody need a blue pineapple? Look at those zebras, those are cool. Hmm. Mask. Now those are all modern masks, but they are hand carved in Africa, in Kenya. All this stuff is. Hmm. Okay, let's get back to it. Alright. Well, we got out of the backside. It's so hard to film in these places because so many people play music and you can't film to post it. So we're gonna go down here and check out Barry and Joyce and show you their table. All right, guys, let's go check them out. All right, here we go. Joyce, Barry, hi guys. Check out this awesome stuff. They make these and they sell them up here at the market. You guys have seen them on our channel. So many cool things they make. You guys, this is some awesome stuff. I love that. Live, laugh, laugh, and love. That American, God bless America, that is awesome. $20, that's cheap. And look at that one, $25. That's high quality stuff. Oh man. See now Joyce made one for Piper that was for the, her dog, Nova. That was a custom one that was awesome. And she loves that piece, Joyce. Oh, she I'm loves so it. Happy. That makes me so She's happy. got Nova's picture, like right here where the clip is and everything. And it's it's an awesome, awesome thing. She was so happy with that. There's so much cool stuff. Amazing, amazing. I like those flags like that. That's pretty neat. That's a neat concept. Coffee time. <laughs> I gotta get you to make me one that says Cuban time. <laughs> oh man. All right, well, we're gonna go walk around and see what else is here. There's so much, so much stuff all over the place here. Check out Webster Market on Mondays. It's packed and it's just hard to film here to show you guys everything because people are playing music. So it's really tough. And it's just so big. It is, it's so big. I started out and back and by the time I got over here, everybody was gone. Oh, back there, they were packing up when we were back there. It's, it's crazy day, crazy day. All right, well, I will see you guys in a little bit, and we're gonna go do some, we'll see what Zoli's up to. All right, so I'm gonna go check on Z, see how he's coming, he should be about done. And we gotta head back to the farm. Oh, I see they're packing up. Oh, let's see. Adam's back now. What's up, brother? Yeah. Z is 
loading the truck. All right, you loading? Yep. All right, I'm gonna go down here and pick out our stuff. Do we have tomato boxes here? Is there two or only one? All right, I'll see if I can find another one. Oh. All right, here's where I come to get the uh, stuff for the mammals. There's our mangoes. stuff here. Oh, there's papayas over there. You get some papayas from over there. And we'll do that. Alright, let me go see what else. Alright, well, now, Z, I remember why I don't film a lot at the market. Because everybody's blaring music everywhere, and we can't film it to show people because of copyright. Mm -hmm. You know, it's a headache. I tried to film as much as I could for you guys, and you guys got to see some stuff, which is cool. But we've got a truck full of food for the uh, pigs, backseat full of food for the mammals. Um, like I said, tortoises aren't really going to get to eat this week because they'll get very little minimal of their inside, yeah. which is fine because they're all nice and fat and they eat all year round. So that's good. But now we're back on our way. We have to stop at the pawn shop. We have to upload a video and we have to go home, unload everything put it away and then we got to put animals in for the night again because we're going to be in the 30s again tonight mm -hmm. it doesn't warm up till tomorrow night nope. and then we only warm up for three days and Christmas Eve is in the 20s Christmas Day is in the 20s and Monday will be in the 30s low 30s so it's going to be nasty but we're on our way to upload our video for you guys. So I hope you guys check that out and I hope you guys enjoy our videos. You guys rock. We love you. Get swamped. And we'll see you back at the farm. Oh, we're finally home. Got everything uploaded. Video should be out. What the hell was that? Let's go find out. Oh, the gators ate some of that meat. And I'm sure the buzzards got a bunch of it. But what's going on over here? There's baby pigs. Yep, they're living up under the pile I piled up. Awesome. All right, we're going to walk around. We're going to walk around here and see what's going on. Well, we figured out what that was. Neighbor kids 
trying to shoot a hornet's nest down out of a tree. Oh, talk about poking a hornet's nest. Z. With a shotgun. <laughs> They're trying to break the branch that the hornet's nest is attached to so they could get the hornet's nest. They don't realize that that nest is full of hornets. And I just told them. So, whatever they do, they do. They're on their property and they're not being dangerous about it. So that's all I can do is put in my two cents and told them that nest is full. You're gonna get stung. Now if they listen, follow the story. That's their choice. <laughs> they're still going, they want that nest. Oh boy. <laughs> Now you would have heard screaming, ouch, ouch, ouch. <laughs> Such is life on a farm. And that's the way the bacon fries. You guys, thanks for hanging with us today. And make sure you get swamp, share your passion, and random acts of kindness that go a long way. And oh yeah. Make sure you hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe to the channel. Because we're trying to put out videos as often as we can. So, I hope you guys enjoy the ride. And remember, love one another, man. There's too much drama and BS in the world. Just get past nope. that. Alright, people. Love you guys. We're going to get back to work. We'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> see ya. Say bye, Z. Bye, Z. <laughs> <laughs>